Welcome to another episode from Brampton Focus. Uh, this one is really kind of interesting. Do you know who the 18th pri uh, Premier of Ontario was? Uh, he was uh, in office from 1971 to 1985. Um, during this period in his government, he was uh, very much concentrating on expansion of uh, the province's public health system, education, and making sure that community colleges remained productive. I'm talking about Brampton resident, who is currently 87 years old, William Davis. So Bill Davis in 2011 was honored uh, by having his name on a building which uh, Catholic Family Services of Peel Dufferin works out of. Um, our guest today on this webisode is Ms. Sharon Devine. Ms. Sharon Devine is the Executive Director of the Catholic Family Services for Peel Dufferin. Sharon, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. Sharon, you've been, uh, you've been in the city of Brampton for over 35 years now with your charity and the good work that you do uh, for the community. In 2011, uh, we crowned the William G. Davis Davis Center for Families. Now this is uh, really an accessible uh, location and it's right in Brampton, right on uh, 60 West Drive. Tell us a little bit about what uh, what your facility offers. So the Honorable William G. Davis Center for Families is a hub of social services. So people can come to us for whatever problem that they might be facing mm -hmm. and be able to access any number of services. Now when you say human services, I mean there's such a raft of human, from a tragedy to trauma to mental, there's so many things. Give us just a little slice sharing well, of some of the things. all of that. So yeah. certainly uh, mental health struggles, addictions, relationship challenges. Right. You might maybe have a, a problem in your relationship that you're not sure how to fix, trouble with your kids, uh, and uh, we have a, a specialty also in the area uh, of violence in families. Now, when you say uh, human services, uh, to what level of medical service attention does, does your facility go to? So we're not a medical center right. per se, we're really a place that offers counseling right. uh, to anyone in the community who might need some support or help. So it's a lot of talk therapy and crisis intervention. So it's a fantastic resource for anybody. So you don't have to say, well, I'm not six, I don't need to go there, or I don't feel that way. You can do a check, right? You absolutely, can, right. absolutely. People can just come. They might be stressed about something, maybe dealing with grief, a problem at work, something the that you're not right sure. There. Yeah, that's our get, building. Right, you can get to it via Zoom anywhere, uh, basically in Brampton. Absolutely, it's a 60 West Drive, and you can see. Now, it must be really cool uh, to have an association with Bill Davis. I it's, mean, there are so many people, whether you're conservative, NDP, liberal, whatever. I mean, what uh, what the Honorable Bill Davis? I want to say Bill as a kid, uh, what he did uh, for our province, and now a resident of Brampton. It's cool that you're in his building. One it's person. absolutely wonderful and uh, uh, Bill Davis is a good friend to us at Catholic Family Services mm -hmm. and to all of the organizations that are there. So uh, we said your name again, Catholic Family Services. We are such a multicultural uh, society and particularly in the region of Peel and in Brampton. We have such a variety of uh, religions and faiths and languages. Um, under your umbrella, are you a full service to everybody? Absolutely, right. so, we are you know, there for everybody right. in the community. We serve the community in 12 different languages, so people can come to us with any issues or struggles that so they might have. So that's a huge point, uh, Sharon. Absolutely. When we talk about languages, when we talk about connecting with the community, and particularly here in Brampton, I mean, it is situated in Brampton, you have to address that absolutely. language barrier, right? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. And many of people who come to see us may be new to Canada right. and are just finding their way you know it's it's a huge issue to get used to being in a whole new community so when we talk about the cost of this I mean we talk about OHIP what if someone doesn't have an OHIP card um, how do you get your funding how do you deal with that little uh, that little element so we're funded by all levels of government right. uh, particularly the provincial government and the region appeal mm -hmm. we also get our funding from the United Way right. as well as Catholic Charities and share life right so uh, they provide us funding to run a number of programs. That so many we donate, offer. people can also uh, make donate, they Absolutely. can uh, bequeath their uh, Absolutely. their, their um, estate, one could say, they can help to raise funds, mm -hmm. that's all important that's aspect, right. right? That's right, that's right, and many people do. They write us a check and uh, those funds go towards uh, providing our walk-in counseling clinic, right. for example. Now, when you talk about unique um, unique aspects of the service, there's, a, there's a, a program called Good Food Brampton. Now, you're thinking, 
Well, what does that mean? It's an actually really unique, tell our folks at home a little bit about this, because what this does is it directly hits youth, and we always want to be able to engage youth and give them something that will help them on their voyage to getting a job and helping them out. So what does Good Food Brampton do? So Good Food Brampton is a culinary program for youth. There's a kitchen that we have and a chef, and the young people come and they learn uh, how to cook, uh, how to become a chef, and then uh, once they've gone through the classroom portion, they then uh, go out into the community and paid employment. So they it's, a, paid it's a gateway, one could say, Absolutely. and experiential. So if you want to get into the uh, food services or the culinary business, Absolutely. there is an opportunity to, to dip your foot in the sauce, as one would say. Absolutely, and right. we all get to benefit from that yep. because Good Food Brampton serves lunch on Tuesdays and Thursdays to anyone from the community who really? comes. That's cool. Yeah, small little social enterprise part of the program there. So for your $8, you can get a full meal, hot, uh, beautifully prepared meal. And done by and done by people with uh, lots of exuberance and young hands. Absolutely, hand, absolutely. Now, you know, we, we talk so much, uh, particularly in provincial services and municipal services, about family services. Uh, you have a safe center of Peel, which uh, is also located right. in this hub. And that's a very important service. And it, and it, uh, it really demands that we make a mention to this. Tell our folks a little bit about that. So the safe center of Peel uh, is a place where people can go when they've experienced any kind of violence or abuse in their families. Uh, and uh, you can access one of 10 services within there to help you navigate through the crisis that a situation of violence precipitates for the family. Uh, we have connections to the hospital as well as to our local shelter. So if somebody needs a place to go, they can first come see us during nine to five and then we'll make sure that they get the services that they need to ensure that they're safe and to ensure that their children are safe. So uh, anybody who is uh, considering uh, seeking out help, they can go to your website. So give us, uh, give us your tag for your website because that would allow them, I would think, to be able to surf through and find out what your services are available and how they could fit in to benefit from it, correct? That's right, that's right. They just have to come go to cfspd.com and they'll see a whole list of all of our services there. And if you connect with us, we can also make sure that you get connected to any one of our other community partners that also provide services. In the community. That's a huge thing because in, in many instances where we all say, oh, we use the internet, we all have our phones. Some people don't have an access unless they go to a library or have a phone. So they need assistance. You're also giving them uh, assistance in guiding them to what other services are available that can help them in their time of need. Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, we can point them in the right direction, get them connected to the services that they need. Uh, I, you know, Brampton's a big community. Yep. People don't always know where to go. Yes. So I want everyone to know that every door is the right door when you come to the Honorable William G. Davis Center for Families. We'll make sure that you get the services that you need. If not from us, then with one of our partner agencies in the community. That's a great statement. Every door is the right door. Every door. I think that's, uh, I think that's wonderful. Now, uh, you talked about, when we talked about funding, provincial, uh, federal, a little bit of municipal from the region of Peel, you also need to garner charitable donations. So you Absolutely. need to do stuff. November 17th, there's a flapjack scenario happening here that uh, is your that's third right. annual. Tell our folks about yes, that. Yes, that's, that's right. We have our third annual pancake breakfast <laughs> with, uh, with real maple syrup and the breakfast prepared by our young people at the culinary program at Good Food Brampton. People can come on out, uh, buy their pancakes and support the United Way while they're at it. United Way of Peel Region is a really important funder for many services yeah. in our community and especially for us at Catholic Family Services. Well, we at Brampton Focus identify that uh, the United Way uh, has a huge uh, piece in our community. They're such a contributor. Uh, Sharon, uh, give our folks at home one last time how they can get in contact with you your website? So uh, reach out to us at cfspd.com. Come to see us, walk in, come by and, uh, and uh, see what we have to offer. We're here for you. Check out the website. They're at 60 West Drive, which is uh, right at Clark and West Drive. It's in Brampton. You can get there via Zoom. It's accessible. Uh, over 17 human services in this wonderful hub. Uh, a service and something that you should be very proud of that is in existence uh, in Brampton. Sharon Devine, thank you so much for being here and for all the great work that you do with Catholic Family Services uh, at Dufferin Peel. My name is Michael A. Chabon. You've been watching a Brampton Focus webisode. If you have an interesting topic or something that you want to bring to your community, 
Please reach us at bramptonfocus.ca. My name is Michael A. Charbon. We'll see you again soon.